Okay, so it's been a little bit since I've played Warframe. Probably, um, the last time I actually, uh, played any missions in Warframe was probably, it, I think at least two weeks ago, so, um, I'm gonna say most, mm, probably more, more so than that, but, uh, I figured I would play a little bit of it but um uh i was just gonna do some um, relics because what am i what do i have for frames to be looking for um okay banshee prime can i even get banshee prime through current relics or is that still bolted right now D6. Banshee Prime Chassis. What do I have? Because that is the only thing that I can get through relics. Okay, so Banshee Prime Systems is what I'd be looking for. Um, Warframe. Chroma. Equinox. Frost. I don't think I have any relics for frost. No, I do not. Um, Naros Prime I have. Hydroid Prime I do not have. Hydroid Prime Systems. Okay. Let me see if I have that. Hydroid. I don't think so. Yeah, no, okay. No hydroid. No hydroid. Um. I might not have any. Any of the uh, things for these. Loki Prime. I'll just look through this and see after I look through. Octavia Neuroptics, but I have the Octavia Prime Chassis and Prime Neuroptics, so I think I'm just gonna... I might just get the Prime version, but then craft the regular version for the uh, Mastery um, experience. Saren Prime... Tania Prime... Infinity Prime... Bobon. I do not have... Bob on and Neuroptics. Well, let me see. Bob on and Hydroid Loki. Okay, Loki and Bob on. So Bob on, I need. What is that? That is Neuroptics. Do I have any? A4 does not have Neuroptics. And then it was Loki, which I think also was, yep, Neuroptics. Because I do have regular Loki, but I do not have Loki Prime, so... Loki... do not have any relics for Loki, so... I think I'm just gonna do, um, some... Uh just passive gain then of prime parts basically just play void fishers choose a random relic and i guess see what other people have um survival excavation okay i think i'm gonna do the excavation let me see what warframes i i don't know no list of the story here we go you know what i think i'll play Valkyr, because I have not played Valkyr um, for a while. Um, and I think I'll keep this loadout. Yeah. If I may say, Operator, your chosen Warframe suits you. Ha, ha. 
But I forgot I changed the appearance of some of my Warframes, so... Let me see. Excavation. Survival. Ooh. Okay, so survival or excavation? If I do excavation, then I'd be getting... I could excavate some more relics, possibly, or survival. I would just wait and see. Survival. Oh, okay, now I remember what survival is. Um... I think I'm gonna do the excavation. Neo A3. Well, what do I. I'll do this by owned. How many do I have here? Z5. Lex Prime. Burst on Prime. Um. About these two. Mesa Prime, Techo Prime Blade, Angolan Prime. Um, I have one of those. I have a blueprint for this. What is the... Okay, Z8. Okay, I've gotten all of these. Z6. You know what? Yeah, no, I haven't gotten this, so I'll... See. Since it is... I have one, but I'll try it. See what happens. God, I have uh, my file explorer open. I'm gonna close that now. Oh! Keep fighting. Look oh. for more reactants. Uh, I'll see if I can remember what abilities I have. Because three, three is like a team buff, I think, and four is then the uh, its ability. I know that's the shout. Two is the team, the team buff ability. Uh, yeah, there we go. Four is the vulnerability if I need to uh, uh, try to save myself from death, I guess. I think my Valkyr has over a thousand armor or something like that, so... Excavator is ready to go. I don't know Keep how how often I'll need to use fire. that. The scanner has picked up a target. Go to the dig site. But I usually um, save my energy because, uh... I forget what it is. It's, um... I think it's a hunter mod or something like that, but basically... Just uncovered. Energy equal health, so... As long as I have health, or as long as I have energy, then I have health. So if I lose, if I lose all my health to like something, then I still have the uh, energy to work as basically uh, extra health. Let's see. Roy, in this locker. Okay. Oh, I didn't even realize that was done. Well, let me. I'll move on to the next one, bring a uh, power cell with me so that I have one for the next excavator. Ooh. There we go. Okay, excavator was not down shield, so drop this. Why so? Whoa. The relic has been cracked open. Finish your mission to find out what's inside. Execution. Excavation complete. Look okay. what we found. On to the next. Extraction is now available. This up. Get, get out of here. 
stand there. Odinata Prime Harness Blueprint. I forget, is is the Odinata the basically what you get beginning of the game, or not beginning of the game, but um like your first uh your first Arkling. I think I think that is the first Arkling. If I'm not mistaken, I'm not really sure. I'm not sure if they did other prime Arklings yet or not. But if they have, then I I wouldn't know. I have no clue. remember if the, if the my other teammates chose a relic or not. But I'm gonna see if we're gonna continue. There we go. I'm stuck to the ice. Excavator deployed. Protect the unit while it extracts the artifact. There we go. An artifact has been located. Proceed to the dig site. Ooh. Okay. Did not break the uh the heater. Because they will keep you keep you from uh excavator deployed. Protect the unit while it extracts the freezing. Freezing. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. What did I just pull? I don't even know what I just pulled. Okay. The excavator has run out of power. Find a cell. The, waiting for me. the excavator has lost power. Find another cell. Seven. Eight. Nice. Get what mods I have on this. I think this is actually like um combined between crit and um status, but I'm not entirely sure. I forget if this was uh, more percentage of crit or status uh, in the first place. So that would fit to what I put on this thing. Went into the uh, bubble, the relic. so I didn't Finish get to use it. But take a look eh. I didn't use any energy though to do it. So either that, or I just got damaged fast enough that it came back right away. There we go. Turn that off for now. Oh, okay. Please. No, F is lower time, so I'll do one F. They're over here in the tunnel. No more shoot you, please. No more shoot you, please. That's cool. There we go, stun him. Blood rush. Okay, so that's crit, I think. Because that's like a uh, um, stalker mod. 
question mark? Uh, I forget what they're called. The, uh... Like, the apprentices underneath the stalker are not really question mark? I, I don't know how that works, but... I'm trying to think of what their name is. But they're... They're... Similar, I guess, to the stalker, I would say. They have different abilities and stuff like that. I think I've only fought them once before. So... I'll have it... I'll have it written down somewhere. Because I had, I had like a dream about Warframe once, and it was kind of like a, uh, I guess it'd be like a quest or something, but basically it was a room where you fought the Stalker and the, um, the group of, uh, stalk, uh, I guess Stalkers, I don't know what you would call them, but, uh, you basically fight them, and then a door opens up. Uh, Ortis is like... Put himself into a turret, and he's like shooting at them. Like, uh... I... I... I think... Is it Dota 2? I think it's like Dota 2, where... You have the towers that you take down. But it's kind of like one of those towers. Like, it's a... It's a crystal that shoots... Shoots stuff. The reactor is working on your I don't know. Relic. Because I, I think I've only played Dota 2 for maybe... I think I played it for half an hour and didn't understand it, so I didn't play it any longer. But, um, oh, that makes me think back, because, like... I was asked to some kind of tournament, and... Um, what was it? Um, TeamSpeak, yeah. I was asked to download TeamSpeak and join a voice channel, and again, I didn't understand even how to use TeamSpeak, so uh, that also didn't happen. But I asked about it, and then uh, I never From got a follow-up afterwards. Because like they asked me I if I would want to do it, and I was like, sure, why not? I don't really know how to play the game or anything, but they still they still extended the invitation, so... Because I, I had it in my library, but I didn't have any time on the game. I, I literally have not... Like, I played for, I think, 30 minutes to try to understand what, what the goal or, like, what you do in the game is, and I didn't, so... Measure Prime. Let me see. That was the chassis. It did not say owned. Okay, so I didn't own it yet. But I do have the blueprint, so... I will craft that. And... Systems and Neuroptics. I don't think I have any actual... Uh, Nesha... Oh, I do. I do have Nesha relics. Blueprint... Blueprint. Neuroptics. Okay, these are max rank, so I guess I did figure that I did have them. Um, I should prime systems. What did I... So D3. I only have one D3. I should prime Neuroptics. This is systems. Systems. Okay. So Neo. Yeah, Neo, Neo Relic, and what was the? Stand by while I analyze what was the, the other one a Neo Relic as well? Cassie Blueprint. Not a number. Did the operator enjoy mm. this criticism? Your optics. Oh, that's Nidus. Okay. So yeah, Neo. Oh wait. Okay, so. Okay, no. Axie. No. Okay. So just Neo Relics. If I find a Neo Relic, uh... Mission. Okay, that is Neo Fisher. Okay. Well, then I'll just look for... Nesha. There we go. Do two. Put permission. Okay. 
question is, does changing the title... Does changing the title split the stream? You found I don't know. Fisher. Look out for reactants. I don't know if it does, but you know what? I'm gonna do it anyway. Looking for Nesha. There we go. Well, it extracts the artifact. The enemies are dropping reactions. So then it'll be split, but the recording won't be split. I don't know if it will split on Twitch, but eh. I guess it would be like a clip, kind of, but not because it's an actual stream and it won't be like a, it won't be 40, like 30 or 40 seconds or whatever, it'll be, you know, minutes, so I'll see how that works after, I guess. But yeah, I'm gonna use my... Nesha relics up then. And see if I can get any of the parts. You can follow me back there, mate. The scanner has picked up a mm -hmm. target. Go to the dig site. Did I get a I don't think I got a follow notification or anything. But um What's up? <laughs> what up, Al? Uh just looking for Nesha as the uh as the <laughs> as the title entails. But um yeah using a Neo something rather relic. Look what we found. Not really sure what that actually is. Excavator is ready to go. Excavator. Keep it and protect it from enemy fire. Oh, okay. I don't even realize that another one has started. Okay, I've been, I was standing in the same spot, just kind of defending Excavator the area. Deployed. Protect the unit while it extracts the artifact. Oh, there we go. I think last mission, um, I said walkers are bound, but was that for the invasion, or was that just, like, in the general, like, more, your mission more, uh, mower design. walkers inbound, and not Razorbacks? Don't know. Ants. Pick up eight rare mods, two out of eight. The excavator has lost power. Find another cell. They dropped a cell. B? An artifact has been located. Are we doing B or C? C. Okay. I think, I think C might be done before B. Oh no. Okay, B B has less time. But I think I think that's where they were was at B. Maybe because there were um there was reactant visibility. Oh, because of Octavia. I forgot that Octavia had that ability. You just kind of go you just kind the of go invisible. Lost power. Okay. Find another cell. Oh. I know this cell. Oh, B is... B is 100%. Rush, sprint speed. That's another thing, I forgot. I do have... Volt Prime parts, but I don't have Volt Prime blueprint, I don't think. I don't know if I have them actually crafted or not, though. Take the, uh, silver. And Condi Prime. I think I mastered these already. 
because it doesn't say there. Search Nesha. Okay, D3. With the systems. Systems and I think I have chassis building right now. So I think it might be systems and neuroptics is what I'm looking for, but I'm not entirely sure. Guess I'll see if I remember. What the heck is that? Okay, it stopped. I thought that was gonna take I thought that was gonna continue the the noise. Break that. Excavator Get these. is ready to go. Keep it powered and protected from enemy fire. Really An artifact has been located. Proceed to the dig site. Proceed into the dig site. Here we go. Oh. Drop ship. I thought it was going to go through the ground. It just seemed like it was... Whoa! Get down there, you please. Do get the Uzi reactant for the relic. Hey, hey. Powerful. Just drop that there. You know what? I'm gonna use these in a while. Forgot how they how they fire. Cause I've been just uh, flaming. Incinerating. Uh, I don't know what you. I don't know what the actual thing is called now. That's it. You opened the relic. Finish your mission Ignis. and we'll take right, a look at Ignis inside. Wraith. That is what that gun is. Dig complete. Forgot it says your it at the bottom right. Yes. Forma. Yeah. I'll just stay on the forma. Because I already got limbo and burst on and I don't think I got the AK Lex yet though. Nesh uh N15 there we go. Neuroptics. N16 Midas. If I have one of those. If I saw that I would have put that on. But I did not. Might do it on next time. Next one if we continue this. Because I know uh, they might have another chance of getting it. Whatever they uh, were looking for, maybe. Because I don't think I have Nidus yet, either. Um, so. Like, I don't think I have... I don't think I got the base or the Prime version yet, so... See about getting that. Protect the unit while it extracts the artifact. Protect while it extracts. The scanner has picked up a target. Go to the dig site. There we go. Excavator is ready to go. Keep it powered and protect it from enemy fire. How much is the range on this? Okay, that that swung into it, but because it's a heavy. It's a heavy weapon, a heavy sword. So. Not sure what the swing range on it is. But I think it's always been my preference to use heavy weapons. Just because of their swing radius and the ability to hit multiple things at once. But I do like the speed of uh, like dual wield weapons, uh, such as like the Nintendi or like the uh, you know, I don't think I've, I don't remember how Fang, Fang swings and how it uses, how it does. 
but um, or like the, I think it's Vanka. Yeah, I think it's Vanka Prime. I don't know if that's the right thing, but the uh, like the claws um, are Valkyr's, I think set weapon. I don't know what you'd say, like the Prime set weapon. But yeah. I like those too, like the fist weapons. Um, I'm trying to think, what have I used? Um, duel. Because I have, I have used the the Prisma duel, like the dual Pris. I think it's dual Prisma Scana, unless I only got the uh, single Prisma Scana. No, I don't think I have used. Like I used, I know I used the dual flame the sword because it was um, like a blueprint that you could craft, but I don't know what else I would have used because I don't think I use um, any dual weapons at this point. Like I don't have any in my uh, in my armory or whatever arsenal. Your hard work has just been rewarded. Okay. Let's see what I get. Baza Prime. What does Prime? Yeah, Baza Prime. Stock. Have I gotten the Baza Prime? I think so. I think I might have gotten it. I'm not really sure as well as that, because I can't remember. Nesha, Yo, 15. You know what? Upgrade. Why not? Even if I have the... Even if I have the, um, what do you call it? Neuroptics. I still get it. It's, uh, it's gold. So, for ducats or whatever, then I can trade those for, uh... For stuff once, um... Baro comes. Excavator is ready to go. Keep it powered and protect it from enemy fire. There you go. Protect it from enemy fire. Will do. Let me see. I'm gonna check this real quick. Okay. So I don't know. Still trying to think about that. Uh, artifact has been located. The message. Proceed to the dig site. I don't know what what they meant, but the excavator has run out of power. Find uh, the cell. Uh, not powder. Not powder. Power. Yeah. yeah. I keep forgetting about the armor value, because like, my shield is, what, 100, 150, but, and my health is 300, but my armor value is 1000, so, in, in that regard, like, effectively, I think I have more health. What, what's seen there? I forget, because there's there's a calculation for it for the armor, armor plus health or well armor. We it's like a multiplicative value of I think 1.5 or something like that. I don't know. I looked it up once because I was trying to. I think I was trying to determine the the, the difference between just regular health and uh, armor health or what is it e it's like effective health That's not you not what you actually way. see but you technically do have inside. depending on yeah. the circumstance because like having having a regular like site. less regular health is for uh, like infested or whatever because they have the uh, the toxin the um, status 
so then they they would bring down your health past armor because it doesn't it doesn't actually uh, like scale with the amount of armor you have. It just kind of does damage no matter what. Sort of like uh, how shield works, where uh, any damage to the shield just brings it down no matter what. There's not really a value. Like, as far as I know, there's not a modification that makes a shield stronger. Your shield is just health, straight up health, and you, if you lose shield, well, like, it, it only, it goes down with the damage they deal, no matter what. Like, it'll go by the damage value that they have. So, like, if I get shot with 100, well, I'm going to lose 100 no matter what, but if I was down to health, well, then I wouldn't lose, you know, I wouldn't lose 100, I'd lose whatever value depending on armor and uh, possibly like uh, other other buffs and stuff. Shield might also be affected in the same way, at least by buffs, but not 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 like health where you have another another value that affects the stat. It's just not a visual uh, effect that you can see, you know unless you actually calculate it and remember by calculation or remember just by uh, doing the calculation and having it in your mind or write it down, something like that, but Shrun Prime. See, I didn't, I didn't know there was a Shrun Prime. Because I have used the, the uh, standard Shrun, but I have not used Shrun Prime before. I didn't even know it existed. I should... Oh, about that. There we go. N16. Our N17 was... Nope, that is not Mesh... Or, not Nidus. So the N16 was Nidus. Forgot, but... rolling. Oh. oh, there we go. Getting to the ceiling. You are not Proceed self. You are not self. Are you self? No, you're not self. Ooh. Okay. Excavators destroy. Protect the remaining dig sites. They were self. Stay with them. Uh, light me on fire. Is heat affected by him? I'm gonna look at what, uh, what modifications I have. I might have not gone with more health just to, um, maybe more rely on, uh, the fourth ability, or abilities in general. Um, I forget what I might have modded this for. Because armor, armor was my main like focus, I remember with Valkyrie, just because the armor value is default, like 300, I think. Has been cracked open. Your is it higher than inside. that? Excavator is ready I don't to go. know. Keep it powered and protect Because 300. Enemy fire. I'm trying to remember, it doesn't. 300 doesn't go sound. Doesn't sound like the value. But. I'm not really sure, because I think Valkyrie might have more than that. Valkyrie might have like 600 or something. Okay, let me see, based on armor, it's like, does the mod go up to 100 armor? And do I have, is there a primed version or whatever, or is it only like a, a standard um, mod? 
trying to think. Because if it's a grime mod, it goes higher, so... Um, and if I'm saying a thousand... 600. If I did 600 and I did, like, plus 100% or something like that. But I don't know if the mod goes that high. I do- I think I have multiple armor mods, but I'm not exactly sure about it. Shield bubbles. Mark, I forget what that does. Like I'm just I'm just trying to uh, remember what everything does now. Cause I I completely forgot. And I haven't played like I said, I haven't played Valkyr in a while, so um, I don't really remember what any of the abilities do besides the rip line and the uh, the last ability. You know what does it is it casting banners or is it displaying a banner for for uh, when I cast Nidus. Oh no, Relic. This might be... this might be extraction. At this point. I don't know. Let me see. Pick up... I'll pick up the cell regardless, but it might be. It might be extraction. It might be extraction. Excavator is ready to go. Excavator is ready to go. Are we? Okay. No. Waiting at objective, or waiting for you rather. The excavator has lost power. Find another cell. Thousand and twenty one points. Hero. Hero chassis blueprint. E three relic. You know, I'll see what I have on this. Okay, upgrade. Operator, you have remembered well how the Tenno arm themselves. Okay, Hunter Adrenaline is the convert plus 45% of damage on health to energy. Uh, Rage, convert plus 40% of damage on health to energy. And then Quick Thinking is the, yep, drains energy to stop lethal damage with 240% efficiency. Continuity, steel fiber, so it is 110% armor. But what is the normal armor value? Oh, okay, so it does give, it gives the explanation. Reduces damage to health by 83%, shields are not affected by armor. By 83%, but then... How does that... Is that saying based on the value that's already there, or... 700, okay. That makes sense. So it was higher. I, I was thinking 600, but it's 700. Um, that might be for... Um, that might be for standard Valkyr. I don't really know. Um, flow, energy max, ability duration. So energy spent on abilities is converted to shield, streamlined, efficiency. Um, so I guess armor was not the, doesn't look like it wasn't the main focus, but I'm not entirely sure. I do have the steel fiber, but everything else looks like... Everything in orders, operator? Is that a pun? That doesn't have any, uh, plus I armor. I to bypass this vault. Yeah. Armor. There, armor. Sprint speed. Okay, plus 45%. 
Let's see, but if I were to put that on, um, what was plus 150%? How much does that drop it down to? 225. Because I had that for... I think this was for extended um, ability use. More than it was armor. Because I do have streamline, auger, auger message, and hunter adrenaline. So these would give more energy. Um, if I was damaged anyway. Low duration and efficiency. Eh, I don't know exactly what this was, cause I think I built I built basically, um, I think I built my frames basically off of survival mode. So anything I did was to survive longer in that. But I think the longest. I think the longest I usually go is an hour and 30 minutes, if that. The one time I went for three hours technically, but it was because of a glitch in the game. Um, but I don't think, I don't know if I'd be able to do that for real. I think I've gone for maybe two hours, two hours and something. But that was um, playing with a, playing with a group of people. Um, I think it got down to me and one other person, and then eventually they left. Or, you know, I think we might have left together, I don't know. Because I don't think I stayed much longer after they did if I if I didn't go. Like, I don't even know if I went another, another five minutes for the next reward or anything like that. I think I might have just left with them. But yeah. Usually. Usually I don't go for, um... I don't think longer than a, an hour and a half or so. Just gonna get a little bit of a. I'm just gonna just gonna get a drink real quick. I'm gonna take a look. I'm gonna take a look at the, the mods I have. Cause I don't think I have any more um armor armor mods to use really, but like I don't know if I wanna replace anything that I have currently, so um Yeah. Carnus Carapace. What? Plus armor, plus health. I didn't even know this existed. This might be... I think this might be a... Not... It might not necessarily be a newer mod, but it's, it's new to me. I've never seen that before. It's plus 10 armor, plus 15 health, and upgrading it would be like, what, 60? It's going by 5s for health, and it would be 50 for armor. I don't know, wait. No, it would be like, what, 65 and 50? Let me see this. Rage, streamline. Streamline is efficiency, which would extend energy for a longer ability duration. Would use less energy on the fourth ability. Low <clears throat> energy max. So I'm getting, I'm technically having more, more energy with streamline on or I just have straight up plus 150%. So I'd have to determine, is the ability efficiency going to equate to longer ability use 
than having the flow on. And that that's the thing. Like, I never really thought about it. I just kind of added whatever... Like, I would just look at it and say, oh, well, this will do this or that, but I don't actually, like, compare, usually. Like, 30%. So what... What, what would be 30% here? Let me see. So the drain... The maximum energy per second drain would be 5 point... 5.87. So let me see. 5.87. 5.87. Well, I guess I would do... What I do... Divided by zero point three question mark? Ah, I don't know. I don't know. It would be times zero point three, so five point eight seven times zero point three is one point seven six one. So then five point or wait, no, it's already it's already doing for efficiency right now for streamline. I don't know what I'm that would just to be that would just get the value of how much it's making it more efficient. So if I remove this it'll tell me, right? Yeah. So I'd be draining at eight point three eight and my energy is four hundred and fifty. So 450. Let me see that. 450 then divided by 8.38 would be about a minute. About a minute if I had full energy for using the uh, for hysteria. Now, let me take flow off and then do streamline and see how long that is because it's 225 but it's at 5 point what 5.87 so then 225 divided by 5.87 38 seconds so having having the flow on would technically be would result in longer. The only thing is, these other abilities would drain more power then, so if I wanted to use other abilities then, then I would use the... If I used efficiency, then it would not be as much. What is this, 5 energy? 5 energy... The 3.5, okay. This uses 75, the 30% drops down to 52, so I'm using almost 25, 25 less duration to our 26.85 seconds. Does that say with, um, because this wouldn't, yeah, that doesn't apply, so low rip line. Valkyr hurls forth a hook. If it hits an enemy, she pulls them to her. If it hits terrain, she pulls herself to the hook's location. Maybe maybe the increased energy value would be... Maybe that would be... Um, okay with having these still drain more. Because, like, okay, Warcry is the buff which would use 75, which then I'd be down to 375 uh, energy to use, which this doesn't activate, this doesn't duly activate, it activates once and it'll say the ability is in use already, I think, when you try to recast it, which would make sense. I guess because the recasting it wouldn't bring the value up, it would just uh, extend the time, so... Um, I think, I think I might take efficiency off and see, or, I might try just adding this, the, uh, Carnus Carapace, and also upgrade it, 
How much does it cost? Is it still just like a... Okay. It, it seems like it scales similarly to other mods. But it's a plus 60% um, gain on armor and health 90%. So like even more health than I already... Well, Valkyr... Valkyr has, what is it, 300, 300 health, so plus 90 would be almost 600, I think. So, killing an enemy with a heavy attack grants, 10% evasion, and immunity to status effects for 2 seconds. So if I do a heavy, then I'm immune to status for 2 seconds. 10% evasion... Grants 10% evasion and immunity. Oh, 10%. Okay, so. Ten percent evasion. And um immunity, I'm guessing it means like it you'll be immune. Status effects for two seconds. So if I just keep heavy attacking over and over again, but then I would have to have a if I have a fast enough heavy attack to not get hit uh, more for more damage, then I'd be more less. I'd be less affected by status effects. So, do it. I mean, it is just a plus. It is another plus health plus All armor mods, mod. Control, so, I have not taken okay, any. no three ninety. So, what's my normal health? Do I have a? Health mod on here? No, I don't. That is the only health mod I actually have. So then my health is 390. What's the normal health value? That's plus 200% health, so. And if I take this off. Okay. Let's see. Just do that. Whoa. Do that. Take this off. It still says plus 200%. So, by default, 300. Wait, what is giving? Goes down to 300. 315. What did I take off that was giving more health? Question mark. Like. It was down to 300, but where does the 15... Oh, because that was when the mod was unupgraded, that's why. Okay. Now I understand. Um, boost damage to health by 83.7. Oh no, does it increase? How much does armor scale? So wait, if I take this off, does this still... No, 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 83.7. Okay, wait. Get out. Upgrade. 70%. Okay, so it does. It does actually say how much it is doing. And because of the way that armor scales... Would I, f would I do armor mods on Valkyr? See, I don't know. Because even putting armor mods on out here, like when when does the armor stop scaling the same? Well, okay, seventy reduces damage to health by seventy percent. It says so. Is back out upgrade now? What does it say? 79.9 .9. So it doesn't scale Does it scale by the hundreds until that point? I'd have to look at a different frame to know Vitality health So Because there, there's an equation but I don't know it I would have to look it up um, Let me see Armor Armor Um here it is. That. Because, like, I, I don't know when... When to... 
to switch it out because if if something would be giving me more health or giving me more of a stat um like a higher stat effect because okay so efficiency is 30 percent and what i did is giving me because like 700 is 70 percent so what i did is 16 percent more 16.3 percent more so is the 16.3 percent like survival wise technically it might be like i might think it's better but like i don't know because then I could use my abilities for longer, but if I'm getting energy drained, like, I don't have any energy to use it anyway, so... Uh, that... That's the thing, like, choosing between mods that do certain things, I'm not really... Not really sure on that. Like, I don't usually go through the, um, what do you call it, uh... Like, I don't usually research. Unless, unless, like, I think, I guess that I'm dying, uh, fairly quick or something like that, I don't know. Because, like, when I was playing survivals more often, I would literally just try to get as far as I can, like, g go for as long as I could, by any means necessary, and that would just be, uh, putting on mods and testing it repeatedly until I got got somewhere that I felt this is, you know, like, I, I, I don't think I would, uh, die as often or whatever, but, nah, that's fine, that's okay, I'll, you know, I'll try it, I'll try it, uh, I'd have to, I'd have to test it, like, like I've, like I said, but, I don't know, excavation, well, I guess I can I can kind of test it in the same the same realm. Um, do I? Or oh wait, it's spelled yeah like that. Okay, I do have one more, which is chassis. So I think I have the chassis and something else. Let me see. Uh. Okay, just the chassis. I just have the chassis. I do not have anything else. I'll check... You know, I'll check if I have anything that is craftable at this moment. Like, I have all the parts and stuff. Let me see. Re or in progress, ready to build. Let's see. Um, okay, so I did... I did already master Baza Prime. I'd have to look at what the price for Baza Prime is going for right now. But, um, Corinth Prime. Okay, I have another one of those. Dread. Winox. Fang. Um. Gorgon. Aros. Bara. Um. X Prime Limbo, Loki, Mag Systems. Oh, I have the Mag parts. I haven't. I don't think I've used Mag yet, have I? I don't know. Do I have another Warframe slot even to... Mag. I guess I didn't use Mag before. Um, This item is part of a bundle. Female Warframe pack. Mag Trinity Ember. Okay. Um... Blueprint. I don't think I... Yeah, no, I don't think I've used mag, so I will build mag. I don't think I have a Warframe slot, though. Mag. 
Wait, what? This is showing all. Okay. There. Okay, yeah, I did not. I didn't master mag yet, so... I'll build the... the stuff here. I'll get mag. Equipment. Inventory. Let me see. Do I have another slot? No, I do not. So I would... Um, I think I'll trade stuff for platinum at some point. Do I have anything... I don't think I have any frames that I would... Yeah. Yeah, no. I don't have any frames that I would get rid of to switch out with mag. So... Oh. Oh. Oh, it's because of the stuff here. I was gonna say. Well, let me... No, no, no. Not listen. Foundry. Progress. Ready to build. What else do I have here? Zephyr. Uh, bolt. Trinity. Techo Prime. Okay, so yeah, I have used the Techo Prime. That's what it is. Um... Infested two-handed grip, its heavy weight provides an increase in damage at the cost of speed. And that's, what we call it, um, uh, like a hilt? I think it's called. Oh, oh, no, not a prime harness. Oh, oh, okay. So yeah, I, this is the, uh, the, um, arc wing. That I was thinking of. So once that's done, I'll build the uh, the prime version of it, and I'll take what forty-eight? No, yeah, forty-eight hours. Um, melee. Rager prime. Okay, wait. I'm handle. Let's see if I remember how this is spelt. That's in caps. Well, you know, I'll just search rhyme. Or you know, I'll just search handle. There we go. Handle. Ram Prime Handle, Redeemer Prime Handle, Redeemer Prime Handle again. Let's see. Orthos Prime. Reowned. I think that's the the one dual weapon. Um Dual commas. Is that the other one I've used? I think so. Avasa Prime. Sentinel Accessory Crafting Component. Oh, there's that. Where am I at for that though? What do I actually own for this? I don't know, wait, is it? It's like K A Y? No. Do I even have the blueprint for that? I don't think so. Rack. Dual Raza. Which is made from dual commas. Which is made from comma. Which I don't have. Okay. <laughs> let me let me see about that. Um can I find it? Come. Is this something I can actually build? 
Yes, this is blueprint purchased two. There we go. Two of those. So now I'm gonna build the Ramas. So comma. Yes. Boom. Build one. Do I have inventory space? I think so. I think I have more weapon inventory space. Oh yeah. One, two, three. So then I could build those two, and then I could build the Ramas. And I don't have any other weapons building, I don't think. Let me see. No, okay. I just have Mag, the Nesha Prime Chassis, the Od Odonata Prime Harness, and a Forma. So yeah, no other weapons are being crafted, so I'll do the Ramas. I don't know how those are, but I guess that'll be another dual weapon that I know what it is. Uh, what it is, possibly. Um, Kogage, or. Yeah, Kogake Prime, I think. Um, silver Golden Knockout with these Prime Melee weapons. Yeah. Nam, Nami Skyla Prime. Um, okay, Prime. Handle Prime Blade. I didn't see those when I was looking at handles. Um, what is this? Oh, this is like made from, uh, like the infested from, oh, what's, what's the planet called now? I can't even remember. I think, I think that's just the thing is I just don't, I don't remember. Vanka Prime. Okay. So yes, Vanka Prime are the bladed these. So I do not have these. Gauntlet. Vanka Prime Gauntlet. Let me see. Vanka... So no, I don't have any relics for it. What other guns do I have? Opticore Vandal. It's... Do I have this? Do that one. And upgrades. What does this? What is this? Main index Rathum. Okay, so I made this for those specifically, I guess. Magnetic and viral. Magnetic. Old and electric damage. Most effective against shields. Magnetic status. Disables the target shield regeneration increases shield damage by up to 325. Combined from cold and toxin damage most effective against Grenier clones, viral status increases health damage taken by up to 325. Okay. Serration. So I have the default because this just increases sprint speed. Multi-shot. Cold. Multi-shot. So higher speed but that would that would increase damage per second just based on the fact that I'm shooting it more often but I could also I could also increase the damage regularly primed fast hands what do I have malignant force critical damage critical chance so criticals and status Cold. Do I have a cold mod that... No, I don't have a cold mod that increases status. So then I would have to... I'd have to figure out where I would get that from. I think I was trying to get it before, but I didn't end up uh, actually acquiring the mod rank. Drain. There we go. Because now it'll do it by however many... Uh, however much capacity it takes up. And Cryo Rounds is the only one that seems like I do not have. Yeah, that's just... Okay. It doesn't have a secondary, uh... A secondary effect. Such as, like, the status chance increase. It's just cold. Oh, let me see. Electricity... Shred, Stormbringer, 
Because I think I made this to be um, effective against Grenier and Corpus, or at least tried to. So that's why it has both the uh, the viral and the magnetic. Or wait, okay. Normally, it's charge shot is viral only. Charged radial attack. Radial attack. So around it, where it hits? I don't know. Index. What does the index look like? Index. I did a radiation. Yeah, radiation. Because I think I think that they take more damage from that question mark. Rathum. Corrosive for armor. So what else do I have? Rock to Cernos. I don't... I didn't remember I had this. Oh. Oh, okay. I do have an, another weapon to use. Penta? I think I might have already... Did I actually... Let me see. Equipment. Inventory. Did I master the Penta? Or you know what? I could have searched it in the... Uh, what do you call it? Chat. No, I didn't. Well... I think I remember what this gun is, this weapon is. It's like a... It's a grenade launcher with charges. I think they're, um, what do you call it, um... Manual detonate, or manual detonation, rather. Blast, all off, radial attack damage. Are either it's either that or it's like a range, like a certain range they explode. No, I think that's a different thing. Shred fire rate. What is the fire rate on this? Reload is two point five. Fire rate one. Fire rate is one, so it shoots one one per second. Question mark. Critical delay. Fire rate. Oh, improves the blast radius of weapons with radial attacks. Bladed rounds. Red split chamber, serration. Red. Um. One per second, but how much does this do? Total. 377 is total, just raw damage. So. Hunter munitions, 30% chance to apply. Uh, magazine capacity, critical chance, I do have primed fast hands but I think I didn't upgrade this because there was something, there was something else that this was on that I didn't go past 8 capacity, I don't think. But I think it is faster than regular fast hands. That's at 6. Where is seven? So yes, it's one. It's it's five percent more reload speed over the the regular modification. So I'll leave that. I'll just do um, vital sense wildfire. What is this impact? This is impact. So. That's if you, I think that's if you hit them directly, and then there's the radial attack, which is the explosion. So it's blast, 927 total though is, oh, 1,762. Vigilante armaments, there we go. I'll just do um, raw damage first then. And that is, yeah, all the way. Usually I would search, what do you call it, multi-shot. Yeah, I would search damage and then multi-shot. But I, I completely forgot about about this. Like, I, I remember serration and the split chamber, but not, not the uh, vigilante armaments. I forgot that this existed. So, multi-shot is 2.5, so it'd be double and then 50%. So 200 and, or 2318.8. Sure. 
skin. What does this look like? It looks like that. I don't know. I think I might... Uh, what if I do colors? You know what? Copy Warframe colors. Okay, that's what it looks like just copied with the skin. And that's without. I think I might like it... I don't know. I might like it without the skin. Because then it's just like... It's just straight up metal. Oh, I actually like... I like how that looks, but it's 25 platinum that I don't think I'm... I'm probably not going to spend that on there. I think that's all actually... Okay, so this is not... Uh, this doesn't look like the shiny. This is just all... Yeah. It's only here where it doesn't... I don't know. I don't know, I... Cause like, this is... this is... Darker, but I could just use a lighter color. And this would be... Like, um... Lighter... Um, this... this like... This looks like it matches more to the color palette. Like this one, I would have to change the color to match more closely, but... You know what, let me see. Okay, yeah, no, I think I just like the default. An unexpected color combination, operator. Just, yeah, just My do that. My sensors are bleeding. Please. Okay, what colors? I was in here. Hey, yeah, I think I might just go with that. Just the solid, the solid purple on it. And what does it look like with this now? Yeah. Still, I still like this though. I'll just go with the solid color. Or as solid of a color as it can be, I guess. Um, here we go. Because then I'll get more mastery. Where am I anyway? Oh, I'm master rank 19. Because I, I did have a conversation about this, but I thought I was lower than that. I thought it was like 16 or 17, not 19. So, I didn't even know I progressed that far into mastery, but... Okay. Defense, Grenier. I'll do it. Oh, and well, then I guess I'll test out the armor value as well. Because I did have increased owned. This is Lith. Do I have anything in Lith that I was looking for? Mesa Prime, I think I have. Uh, do I have the... yeah, two. Um, Stradivar, I own one of those blueprints. I do not have a blueprint of... Wukong anymore. So I might get that. I have 23 of these. I'll just... I'll just use one without uh, refining it anymore, because, like, like I said, 23 of them. So that's that's 23 chances to get a gold, uh, a gold um, drop. Reinforcements are inbound. There you go. Hold the line. Oh, but, <laughs> well. A fissure. Defend yourself and use reactant to open relics. I didn't mean to activate the mission, but uh, I was, I was, I was coming in hot. Because, like, I think they were waiting for someone else, but I... I started it before another person joined. So. They're dropping reactant. 
Use it to crack open the oh yeah, that's right. That's what I was gonna do. <laughs> I completely forgot. have a um, button set for uh, I don't think I have a button set to actually um, to use my secondary on this unless this doesn't have it like a secondary I think it might just Okay, now... Uh, mouse click? My gun is not firing. Is it because I have... Oh. Okay. I do have... Okay. I have it bound. I have it bound. I so my secondary fire is also the heavy melee. That's oh, that's why I forgot. I couldn't shoot because I had all the charges down. There we go. Yeah, there it goes. Whoa! I killed him with the impact. on this. <laughs> Whoa, they flew. Okay, so it is still three. The relic has been cracked open. Finish your mission to find out what's inside. What did I just do? <laughs> I can blast myself with it and it just like, it stuns me. Oh, it knocks me back. I didn't even know you could do that. I guess it's because I don't use launchers, usually. <laughs> oh wait, let me just test my armor value. I'll just stand right here and let them... Okay, yeah. Let's see, but they're they're level nine and they're doing that much damage. That, to me that seems like a lot of damage that I'm taking still for level nine. Anyways. So maybe the armor value isn't isn't the thing that I will bot for. Not really sure though. Cause like after, if it doesn't scale by the hundreds, like, you know, uh, like 600 would be 60% or something, I'd have to check, I'd have to look at, um, maybe not Rhino, unless Rhino has less than 700 and then I would look at the value like that. But I don't know if the value... Okay, again, I guess it would just... I would have to just look. A lot of warning shot. Kill 500. It's okay. Those fall. Whoa, wait. 
there's like a lot on question mark. Extraction is ready. Unless you can handle more of the enemy. <laughs> Gonna give me a sticky keys warning? Okay, no. I think I turned that off. I think I turned sticky keys off. Vampire weenie. W2, that's what it is. Okay. C9. Oh, wait. C9. Oh, I was gonna check. Keep fighting. Another opportunity to extract will appear soon. This weapon, just because you can blow yourself up. You know, usually that would be a thing that you don't want to happen, but I find it, I find it amusing. It's very good. It's a very good feature of this weapon. Ooh, and they're gone. It doesn't actually, like, it doesn't actually explode them, it just launches them. Like, their, their body doesn't, you know, they don't get dismembered, it just throws them. That'd be interesting if, like, throwing the enemies away at a certain speed would actually do more damage. I shot them in the head. Oh, it bounces off of bodies, too. Off of dead bodies. Get out of here. Whoa. I want to stab my head again. Ah. Okay. Yes, that is friendly. I couldn't tell. It doesn't it doesn't have the thing above it. Like it doesn't show the uh speaker. The heck? Options. What are my display options on? Okay, everything everything is on high or whatever, so I don't know why that is. You know, why it's not showing the actual effect? Cause like it just looks like a normal roller, so I thought it was uh, like a grenier, grenier one, an enemy. Go. Over here. There we go. Oh, it goes through walls too, the explosion. Wave cleared. One more reactant. Go. Just like shoot. Them up. There we go. Oh, with this. That's it. You opened the relic. But because of bonus. 
rank 9. Okay, so with bonus I'd be rank 9 with this weapon. Or rather, I'd be at rank 9 with this weapon. Whoa! I like, I like the, uh, like, evasion move when I shoot. I don't know, I think I'm, I might do fire rate on this. I might put more fire rate on this. I, I, I think, I think, uh, the, the, uh, what do you call it, the, uh, investment into fire rate might be a thing to do. Change this now. Penta. There. Just change the stream name to just Penta. Of That actually momentarily disoriented me. The the explosion from whatever thing they're using. It's like the the distortion effect on the screen. I wanna get in there. I wanna I wanna I wanna be in that. I wanna be in the blast radius, please. Oh yes. Oh, Oh yeah, like the distortion particle effect. Very good, very good. From over here. Very done. Oh, hey. Hey, you. Continue to blow, blow myself up. Whoa! Hey. That is. That is. It didn't stun him. It didn't stun him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Reinforcements available. Do you choose to leave now or continue fighting? Rubico Prime, Paris Prime, Upper Limb. Yeah, I'll just do. Oh, they're doing Rubico Prime. Yeah, I'll just stay on the Paris Prime Upper Limb. C9, H3. So maybe it's defense missions that are more, um, give more relics. I'm not really sure, because, like, I think the excavation, but C9. Just do a C4. Continue to defend. C4, you G4, and then C9. Which, I don't know this. What is this? Oh. Okay. Didn't even know there was. Well, I never actually looked at that, but. Whoa. The grab move. Like the the initial arc for them looks like it would be like it's a heavier projectile, but then once it once it actually starts dropping, it starts to slow a little bit. I'm just gonna 
Is it like artillery? Oh, I do that. Pull myself up again. Because the bounce. Oh, there it goes. that weapon. Send Prime? Nudies. Rock the Dark Dagger. Nudies? Okay. I think it might be a custom weapon. There. Well, you know, I guess this turned out to be the weapon that I expected it to be, but like I said before, I think I might might do some um, fire rate on this. It's one, it's one per second. There's five projectiles. It just, I don't know. I've always liked um, like faster firing weapons than I have uh, like slower, slower firing, even if it does more damage. But I guess it does also depend on the type of weapon. Because like, for a while I've been just using the Ignis Wraith. It. And technically, relic. it Finish fires we'll take a look slower than some other weapons that I have, but at the same time, it's just consistently a, a flame. So, I, I don't know if I would really call, call it fire rate by that. But, um, in the stats, technically. Like I have the what is it called? Oh, I can't I can't remember what it's called now. Uh, yeah, I'm lost. I don't remember the name at this at this, uh, this time. But figure it out when I get back to the arsenal. But it's it's prime. It's prime. Well, that's all I know, is it's a prime weapon that I have, but I don't know what it's actually called. Um, what else do I have, actually? Do I own any other... Um, faster firing weapons? At least by... Uh, how I see it, like, I, I can't think of... Do I have... Gr I don't think I have the good models like the dual Gracadas. I think I might have built the... I might have the... I might have a Prisma Gracada, I just don't use it because it's not the, uh, it's not the dual ones. And I have the AK Jagara or whatever. Um, which... damage-wise, like, I think does more damage, but again, they're... they're like semi-auto, but they still fire... Let me see. Like... It's still just... There's an enemy. Over there. Oh wait, there we go. Like, they still fire like that, which I still find them fun, fun to use. We got what kind of enemies that we were fighting. Like level 15 now? But they were level 9 to start with. But we are on wave. Do they scale? Okay, no, 17. I was gonna say, do they scale with the waves? on Earth, I think this is. So, I'm gonna say, do they just scale with the waves, like their level? Because then, you know, they do level 14 on day 14, but there was some level 17. Maybe level 13. 
there is some variation in level, but by how much? Might be like one or two levels that they vary. Until like uh, later waves, maybe. Zip line. Bird. Whoa. Okay. I was gonna say, I don't think. I don't think that was my projectile. We got the pink projectiles. Whoa! they bounce? Okay. That was like one, two, three, four, five. Five bounces. But it didn't, it didn't bounce like the same distance off the first time. They're sending Noxes at wave 15, okay. Extraction is ready. Unless you can handle more of the enemy. Oh, that was <laughs> that was a uh what do you call it? Um a night wave thing. <laughs> I didn't even know. But now I do. Bang Prime. Yeah. E3. That's the last of them. Objective is secure. Let's go home. Rank 15 with that. So halfway to 30 with the Penta. Excellent armaments, operator. I do not Please have another modification slot, but sixty. You know what? I'll try. Our fire. That is okay. It is fire rate like that. Um, shred plus thirty percent. At the highest value. No, 60 is the highest. Minus 15% damage. Uh, 90% too. Oh, now I'll just mod this. Yeah, I'm just gonna mod this for fire rate, even though, like, I'm gonna say maybe the average person would not do that. I'm just gonna do it anyway though. Let's see what happens. Minus 15% weapon recoil, but minus 6% fire rate. Not gonna do that. On reload, 12.5% fire rate when aiming for two seconds. Let me see what else is available after doing what I just did there. Minus damage though. Slash, heat, toxin, electric, punch through. Punch through on this. Operator, I've run diagnostic regressions. All systems nominal. You don't need to thank me. Damage to Grenier, bladed rounds on kill. Critical damage, critical chance, cryo rounds, firestorm, blast radius. Sure. There we go. Now I'll see what happens with this. 
So now I can fire two, almost three projectiles. Mobile defense, mobile defense, defense. Here we go. Um, 10 5. W2, there it is. Homecoming Prime and Cryo 93. Our position has been compromised. Defend the cargo until reinforcements arrive. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Watch out. I'm detecting void fissures nearby. Do you have a matching relic? I like I like the fire rate, but how's the damage and everything else going to be is the question. Because I did have, what is it, 150% damage added with the other stuff. Now I just have fire rate. So, whoop, whoop. Found a fissure. Look out for reactants. Forgot they explode. Like, all of them explode when, when I hit it. Yeah, no, I... I Definitely like I like the fire rate, but let's use a sniper ammo. Okay. I guess it doesn't have a specific ammo type really, it just is it's sniper ammo. Well, there we go. Love folks who love what they do. Use that reactant to open a relic. Don't forget the reactant. You need more to open that relic. Might do a reload on this next. Cause I do I do I like the fire rate. I I, I actually I, I like the fire rate on this. Just and because of it because of what it is, like it's a it, it, it's a grenade it's basically like a grenade launcher, but it uses charges, so You like you. <laughs> I think it's <laughs> like hurting my forearm trying to do it that fast. <laughs> Feel the burn. <laughs> yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good. I'm trying to do crouch. Too much crouch. Too much crouch. So. Uh, reload speed. Because the fire, the fire rate for me, I, 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 yes. But the reload, uh, okay. Okay. I think modding this, I think modding this for the, what do you, what do you call it? Would it be called non, non-conventional modding? But I like I like doing it this way. I forgot I also so I could switch out blast radius. I think that's what I put on this. I could switch out blast radius for fire rate. out of ammo <laughs> like ammo capacity reload speed what else would I do on this thing depending on the mod slots I might be able to I might do a damage but I think I'm gonna do yeah re reload fire rate uh, ammo I still have more left over after doing uh, 
reload speed, because I don't think there's, there might be two or three reload speed mods or something like that, so. But I only know of uh, the one, like the fast reload, whatever it's called, so. I'm not entirely sure. I think, you know, I think, I think I'm getting pulled back, pulled back into the game a little bit. Cause like, for a while, I didn't play the game, I didn't really have an objective. I mean, at this point, I don't still, besides getting my mastery rank up, cause right now I'm at 19, which is more than halfway, um, I guess, but it's, it scales, I think, at each time, so it'll be more and more as you go along, uh, but in in the sense of just looking at it in the rank number, I'm more than halfway through, like, because uh, I think the max rank is 30 for mastery, and I don't know how much XP, like, scales with each mastery rank, if it does at all after a certain point, but, um, yeah, that, that is my current my only current object objective at this point, because I have done, I think I finished all these side missions and stuff that I can at this point, and I did do the main quest line or whatever, main storyline, whatever you want to call it, uh, but that is my only objective, is level things up, so for a while I didn't come back because I didn't think I had anything to level up, so now I do, and I'm also building like another arc wing, another like, uh, what do you call it, another weapon, because I didn't think about it before, but now that I know, may I may play some more of this. You know, I just thought about it as well, I have not been using my abilities. Bring down my shield. <laughs> keep repeating it. Do that, give a uh, team buff. Reinforcements available. Do you choose to leave now, or continue fighting? Octavia Prime Systems. Guess I don't own that, so I'll go with that. Still a prime receiver. I also don't own that, but I go for I go for the frames first, so. Hawk Crow. B4. Do I have any B4? Yes, I do have B4. Bolts are prime. Okay. Oh, I didn't. I didn't. What do you call it? I didn't uh, refine it, but I could have for the Bolter Prime. I think I actually have all the parts for Bolter Prime, if I'm not mistaken. I just don't have the blueprint. So next one, next one. If if we continue, I'll I'll do it uh, next time. If not. Then I'll do it on a different, uh, either with a different team or in a different mission. Because how long has this been going for? Eight minutes. So I think this one was up for 25 minutes. So if we go, if we don't go for longer than uh, what do you call it? that, then we can. I'll just, I'll just do this one again. I'll just do this mission again. So. I might catch it when it's, you know, 
just about over, but yeah, I'll see. I'll see. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but just I just do do do. I killed him with the impact. And the impact. Okay, for me, this this sword, this this is just satisfying to keep, keep swinging. But like, the only thing I can think about this is yes, and then this just yeah, satisfying to swing. Just knock him back with this because of the fire rate. I like. Missed. There we go. Bounced. Whoa. <laughs> this is blue on my bottom. Okay, there okay, I buffed, buffed the team. Since I remembered that it exists. I think it's just the weapons. Like, I get... I get, uh... Like, more focused on the weapons, and then I just don't end up using the abilities. Buff again. Like just I don't know what it is. Just comparatively to to the one one per second, just the the five, you know, the five and like two. I think I would prefer though if, if it was like on impact explosions, you know, not like charges. So I think the Tonkor is the one that does that on impact, if I'm not mistaken. But it's a it's a grenier grenade launcher, I think. Uh, but I think I might have used it. Maybe I used it once, I don't know. Either that or I've just seen videos of it be used. I think I saw a mod guide for that. Like a modding guide for the actual weapon. But I don't know if I actually... So here's the thing, if I, if I did use it... I would master it. Like, I, I try to master all the weapons before I sell them, so... Like, if I if I end up liking it, though, I'll keep it, and... I don't think I... I don't know... I don't think I used it, actually, at this point. Thinking about it now. Because if I... If I had... You know, maybe it would have been, like... I feel like it might have been, like, this experience. But that... If it's... It might only be, it might be a single shot. That's maybe why, if I did have it at some point, I wouldn't have kept it. Because it's a single shot grenade launcher. And this is like, you know, this is five, but they're charges. So they're not on impact. They're not instant explosion. So. But I think I prefer, like, a, an explosion on impact. But that might also be... Because these these arc um, like when you when you fire it initially, the arc seems like it would be um, like it would fall faster uh, than it does. But after the initial shot, like it it feels like it goes um, like the distance is uh, you know what's up. Got him. 
about that. There you go. <laughs> they're like, did they like slap him? What was that? Did they? Oh, they're right. That's what it was. <laughs> you alive in there. I can pull him. I'm like moving them away from the thing though. Here, I'll get him. There we go. Yeah. There, now they're... Now they're in the middle of the, uh, what do you call it, the pod area. So they're, I think they're so celestial when they stay closer to, to it to defend. Oh, they got, they got picked. Oh, they're down. back. Okay. <laughs> oh wait. Nope. Can I pull them over here? Oh they wait. They are. They're moving. Oh. Yep. Oh what? Uh, uh. Hey. You get back here. You get back here. Extraction is ready. Unless you can handle more of the enemy. <laughs> uh, oh, I own that. Wait, I own that? I think I own Next Prime already too, but I'll I'll do you know, I'll get the blueprint. I'll get the blueprint. So I am missing a part, I guess. Oh, B4. This upgrade. Oh, no, wait. No, I own that. Yeah, oh, sure. I don't I don't think I have the axe. The Skindo. Or Sindo, I don't know how it's said, but yeah. Oh. I didn't get him. I didn't get him on the pod. I went to make a coffee. Oh, okay. <laughs> there, now they're on the pod. Now they're on the pod.
10 more levels, and we'll be at max rank. Can I go through? I think I'm going through the wall. I don't think this has them. What do you call it? Uh, punch through? Yeah. Good. Now we're winning. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's funny. That's good. That's it. You opened the relic. Finish your mission and we'll take a look inside. Loads. This is time. <laughs> Just like being pulled away while playing the guitar. <laughs> I forgot that exists, the, the schlazen or whatever. That's funny. Creating, creating my own fun. I didn't even know. I forgot it existed. I forgot about the emotes. It's all coming. Can I, unable to activate vehicle. I was gonna say, can I just have this here, please? Rank rifle. Does this work on them? Where are they? Distance to target. No, it says. Oh. 
<laughs> Fishing spear. <laughs> Uh, does that work? Can it pull him? Let's see if it can pull him. Oh, I missed. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, I missed again. Oh, they're dead. Oh, they're dead. It's great. Can I hit him? Oh. Got him. Ooh. It went through them. Did it? It went through them. Do I have to be right at them? Oh no, it does just go right through. I think since I pulled out that trank rifle, my or no, maybe it was the Swazin or Swazin. I think that's what might have. Thousand, okay. What do I have? Tempo. This one. What is this? My Maestro? Yeah, there you go. Now we're talking. Oh yeah. They got all the dance moves too? Heck yeah. What's this one? Oh, this. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, there's just there's, there's, there's a little bit of enemies around too, but we, you know, we're just doing a little bit of dance. Just having a little bit of fun. Oh. Uh. This 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 one this one for sure is been since it. Rubico, Arus. Okay, okay. Oi. Oh heck yeah. Oh. Ooh. Ock Karelu. Oh, 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 they're leaving. We're done here. The extraction gonna say, if they didn't, take over from here. If they didn't I end up leaving, I would have stayed. Like, uh, what do you call it? Famara, that's what it was. Upgrade. Excellent armaments, Operator. Please return covered in blood. Safe and sound. Fire rate, fast hands. Seven. Do I have a fast hands? Fast hands, there it is. How much? Two. Two seconds. Um, blast radius. I don't know. 
Eh, I'll keep it. I'll keep a two second reload. This is the... what is this looking like? Ten hours. Ten hours. That's all. Ten hours. Five hours for this. Um... Do I have anything else to level up? Because I... I didn't know I even had the Penta, so... Redeemer... Operator, Rumble did you Jack. hear that? It said... Right. And I didn't, Cosmic background radiation is a riot! I didn't master this, so... Upgrade it. Let me see. This. I have it on drain already. Condition overload, and... Primed pressure point. There's another one, isn't there? I thought there was another thing. There's blood rush, but what does this look like? Okay, this is status. That is duration. Focus energy. This is electric. Um, Fury. Do I do attack speed on this? I don't know. Quickening. Attack speed. Fury. True steel. Vicious frost. This is electricity. Um. You know what? Oh, I do have a cold for that. Blast. Toxin. Cold. And electricity, and what is it? Oh, fire. Or... I don't remember what it's called. Focus on you, Berserk Fury. Wickening Fury, um, what is it? Volcanic Edge, there we go. There, I'll just throw... Oh wait, do I have... Stance as well? Stance. Yeah, Stinging Thorn. Oh wait, that means it has more mod capacity. Yeah. Lurker Fury, attack speed. You know, I'll do attack speed. Why not? Um, Z5. Yeah, that's what I own, so I figure. I figure I'll do that, because I don't know what I would be looking for um, in, in the, T the T3 Fisher. I don't know what relic I would be looking at for something in specific. What is this mission? The enemy is at Defense. our doorstep. You must defend our equipment until reinforcements arrive. Watch out! I'm detecting void fissures nearby. Do you have a matching relic? Ooh. You know, I like I like the stance on this, but I don't know how this weapon is. 740. I did 740 slash. Thank you for that. Reinforcements are inbound. Hold the line. <laughs> oh, I ran out of energy. I was gonna pull them all the way. No, there's no energy in that. Not in there either. Come on. Any more in, in, in any of these? I didn't see what kind of damage that was. Oh. Oh, I didn't say either.
That was for one hit. <laughs> that was litter. That was one hit. That's good. I think they waved to me. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> oh, they have a frost, so yeah, there we go. Snow globe. Sure. Defend yourself and use reaction you know what? to open relics. I didn't think about this, but I think I don't. I don't know what the frost experience is. I've never had, I've never had frost. Because like the we the snow globe or whatever is, you know. I've seen people say on forums and stuff like Frost is like one of the best for defense. I've used I've used Gara before, but Frost. Frost I have not. Because Gara you can keep you can smash the walls when they're damaged, and it will release shards and hit enemies with the shards. The snow globe, I think. Does it freeze or stun? I can't remember what it does when it explodes. Cause like, it can be recast or you cast at it and it disappears in the sense that it like, I think it releases a cold blast. I didn't even put um, what do you call it? I didn't change the colors of this yet either, but. Oh yeah, that's right, I put the reload on the Penta. I'll see that's like... Oh, 8,000. Okay. This first status seems like, uh, like so far, I think I want to There we go. Like my melee, whatever it's called, I can't even remember already. The Rumble Jack. Yeah, so far I think I like it. The relic has been I like the, um, I like the stance that I put on it, but that doesn't really account for the, the weapon stats in general. See, I haven't, I didn't try it without putting a, uh, like, speed, uh, like, swing speed mod on, but... Ooh, let me stand in that some more. <laughs> Ooh, that feels really good. The noise, the noise. I didn't know it did that. You know, because I would usually avoid that, but, you know. Just go, just go stand in the, in the beams. It's pretty good. Pretty good noise. Just like the sound of your skin being burnt. Oh, that... Okay. Now I remember what the second ability does. Your swing speed looks... It looks like the swing speed went up. Oh yeah, there we go. Yeah, no, I think... I think I might spend some more time in this game now. Again. Where the heck? Is there a laser beam cutter thingy up here? 
I want to stand in it so I can hear the, the zappage. I'm getting laser burned. Slam attack shocks. Oh, yeah. Okay, yep. It's kind of like the heat swords. But it's zapping them instead of lighting them on fire. Like it all, uh, what do you call it? It all stun off them. Is that over the shoulder? What am I doing? Oh no, that's like behind the back. Behind the back, over the shoulder. Yeah. Jack. Jack. Oops, there's someone down unintentionally. Oh, yes. Okay. I didn't realize how loud that was, but that literally peaks. That just peaks the audio. Is it really? Oh, when they're talking, it doesn't. Oh, there it is. Peaked. I'm swinging. that the pot is making in the in the selection screen. Affected Zephyr. Mr. Ivan. Ivan! 98! Uh, here we go! Battle. K3. Echo Prime. Thero Prime. N17. Nesha. Oh, that's the Nesha one. Keep fighting. Another opportunity to extract will appear soon. Am I throwing it? Check my uh, night wave when I was back at the ship, but I think I might have a tier complete. 
uh, based on the uh, the uh, challenges or whatever. I might check that one. As long as I don't forget to do it. I did not mercy. There we go. What? Yeah, I was just waiting. I knew they were affected by status, so. That's it. You open the relic. Finish your mission and we'll take a look. What does inside. doing that do? And I'm not talking about, like, how many things it can hit in its swing, just how far it will swing. Like, how fast it pulls you. Here you go. Oh, yeah. Now we're talking. I don't think that gives me energy either, even if I have the uh, Hunter, Hunter Adrenaline and uh, what is it, the other, I don't know what the regular one is called, Rage? I think it's just Rage. The Hunter Adrenaline and Rage, I don't think I get energy from just standing in those beams. Because damage from enemies will give me uh, energy, but... I block it? I don't think so. I'm just trying to block it with my melee and see. How much damage have I taken? Wait. Damage taken 38. I'm surprised it isn't more than that. Just because of the, uh, what do you call it? Just standing in the beam. They stopped. They took. They stopped and looked. But <laughs> uh, it's funny. Uh, it's great. Here. Oh, I thought they were closer. Because I was going to try to buff them both, but they were not both here to buff them.
think that's only when it, um, only when the status actually is in effect. I thought it was doing it all the time, but I think it's only when the, uh, what do you call it, the viral effect is, um, is going. Yeah, get on the line. Get on the line. Get on this line. Drop down. There we go. Just had to roll through those lasers real quick, don't we? Oh, I didn't buff. I didn't buff either of them. Wait, I thought they were. Oh, well, maybe they weren't there before. Okay, this is what I'm gonna do. Oh wait, wait. No. I'm just gonna try to kill him. <laughs> They're spinning. Oh heck yeah. I'm gonna try to pull them onto the pod. Oh, are they? Are they okay? Oh, yeah. They're late. Oh, no, they're not. Oh, wait. Did I get them? Oh, I didn't get them. I was trying to get them onto the pod. There, do that. Okay. <clears throat> I was trying to, I was trying to see if I could pull over here if they didn't move, but they moved. Where'd they go? Oh, there they are. Invalid target. Was I aiming at the, uh, what do you call it, the sentinel? Got it. Yeah! Whoa! Heck yeah! I got him up there. I, I moved him into position. <laughs> there we go. Now I got them both. Vanilla Fire actually uh, let me recast it then. Because they took it down, but then I put it back up after I recast it while they were both actually in the range of it. So, it works. Here we go. I did the damage challenge. I keep forgetting what it's actually called. Rumblejack. Whoa! noise that was making. It's like, it's like the lasers hitting me. Just the tick 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 Ooh! Okay. I'm gonna switch the title to... Rumble Jack. Is it just one word like that? Done. There we go. Extraction is ready. Unless you can handle more of the enemy. Are they here? They're not. I'll stick with this. Um Are they here, or are they not? Ooh. They're here. Okay. That's the last of them. Objective is secure. Let's go home.
personal and to 26 8 okay so now I can put the here reload primed fast hands 35 so that is the highest capacity used magazine capacity quad spring loaded chamber aerate when aiming okay so it's down to 1.9 but the I think I think I'll just do the other one then because wait a second reload speed still down to 1.9 oh maybe because the leveling up so then that still says 1.9 for that too yeah I'll just keep the regular fast hands on then oh wait what's the reload without it 2.5 okay so no it is that got it actually is just down to one point oh no, wait ew Okay, I'm confused. Upgrade. Excellent armaments. Upgrade okay, no, it is 1.9. Please return covered in blood. See, because I think it was two before Safe with answer. these, with the fast hands, but I guess, guess it is not. Seven drain. Let me see. Seven toxin. Status duration. What's the status chance on this? Ten critical chances. Ten as well. So how much does that bring it to 16? 16 status chance with Toxin. Um, Thermite rounds, Vital Sense, Critical Damage. It's damage. Duration. I don't have, I didn't even think about that. I don't have a damage mod on, but that's because I was doing reload and, and fire rate on this. normal serration would be do I have just a non yes I have a non leveled up serration mods do I have one that's at 7 serration no I don't so then I'll do I'll just do this serration up to 7 you know yeah why not because then I can use it on stuff that I don't have the capacity otherwise to do, so. But it would normally be the first mod that I put on, so. Everything in orders, operator? Just do that, Is that for, for the time being, because hmm. it's, what, to to this fault. 260 yeah. endo, was it? I don't even remember. Um, mechanic Edge, I have three capacity on this, so what can I put on? with three capacity. I'll just scroll through see what the drains are on these. What's two capacity? Sundering Strike is Puncture. This doesn't have Puncture as a uh, damage type. Status chance 15%. Whoa wait the status is one oh okay so wait, it's always going to have a status effect? Well, I guess that makes... No, but wait, it has impact too as a damage type. Okay, okay. I didn't even know that. But this is like... This looks like pure... I would just go with status and critical chance is like... 14%? So wait. I don't even know what that means. If it can, if its status is 118%, how... I don't even know how that works. Rifting contact. Oh, that's 20. And that's plus combo duration, so actually that. But... I... 120% status. How does... 
The chance that a hit will apply status effect based on the types of damage the weapon inflicts. But how... How does status chance work when over 100? When you hit a status chance greater than 100, a single damage instance will be able to create two status effects. That means if you have a shot with 200 status chance modded with both blast and toxin damage, that single shot will result in both status effects. Okay, so it's not just a chance to create a status effect, it is a chance to create two. So if you are over 100, I have another 20% chance to create another status on top of the one that I just did, or of the same status effect. That is interesting. I don't think I've seen anything like that yet. So, I guess that's why... But, I don't know. I don't actually, like, visually I didn't see that, but... I guess I know now that it does that. Uh, copy wireframe colors. Okay, yeah. Skin selected. This has that and this. Okay. Attachments. Forgot I had these too. Well, I'll do the. F Will I do the fire? Well, copy main colors. Now do this. And I'll do that. Holster style, dagger standard, hip. Where, where, and when did I get this from? That's not even... I don't have it visible anyway when holstered, so... Do I have a... I don't have a Cyandana equipped. But... There are one that I would equip on this. Well, okay, first copy main colors. That works. I don't I don't know if I'm going to equip one on this or not on Valkyr. That that Guva Solstice cloak. Actually You know what? Yeah. Is that see but that that f I feel like this matches like either this or I don't know though cause like just without anything maybe I don't usually just don't put anything, you know, but I might just go without putting anything on. I mean this, you know, I I kind of I kind of like like this, but eh, just go with nothing. Necrolisk Demos. Oh. Okay. <laughs> sure, why not? <laughs> uh. That's what this planet is called. Demos. Necrolisk. Wait a second. Okay, so this is just the entrance to the to the place. Can aim? Oh, I can. I didn't know you could do that. Like, 
or you know what? I I do recall being able to do it, but I know. Yes, you. I guess you can aim while you're in, in here. Just. Take a walk. Here we go. You know what? There we go. Just reduce it back. There we go. Let's take a walk. Let's take a walk down the stairs. Where am I at? I'm at... I'm almost at three hours. Okay. I'm gonna take another drink. And... Oh, I'm just thinking. Okay, so I was thinking. I was gonna make my number pad buttons as, uh... What do you call it? Um as maybe seen transitions or like hotkeys or whatever but I don't know how that works like when I do would I switch it to um like would I have numlock on or off to do that because numlock would just mean that one one through nine on the regular keys I think would still effectively do the same thing which because like it would be it would control in game still as one through nine for some games and I don't think I I don't want to bind it and have it you know be something in game but okay that's what that light is for because numlock is on yeah because that's still it's thinking that's an ability, so if I press either with numlock on or off, it's still saying number pad 4, like number pad 1, 2, 3, 4. Like all of those still, they do, they do the thing. So, you know. NPC JPEG. NPC dot JPEG. Epicness one two eight. G Soza? I, I don't know how to read that. Oh, they were here, but where'd they go? Did they go back to the ship? Map? Moon Mappo. They might have. Isolation Vault. Wait, am I able to do this? Wait, yes, no? Question mark? Mabel? Much has been hidden from us on Deimos. The old ruins oh. beneath the surface must I surely am. contain the deepest and darkest secrets. Find a way to get inside, and the Necroloid will guide you through. Okay. See what's happening down there. Tell me what he has been up to. Wait a second. Is this the first? Like, is this the introduction mission to... To Deimos? Deimos? However you say it? Is this? Oh, they're gone. Where'd they go? I'll spin. I'll just spin. I'll just spin. I'll just spin. Whoa. Their head. It doesn't let me out. Oh, there it goes. It wasn't initially letting me out. There we go. 
Guess it wasn't loaded, but Ev Metal joined squad. There we go. Projectile incoming. Not anymore. I think this is their... Is this the, I think this is the introduction mission. If you gather the correct materials, you can persuade the infestation to open up for us. Think of it like gathering bait. I avoid samples from <laughs> can supply us with a biological gain prime two. Is this a? I think this is an end question mark or this is a bounty? I don't know. Worm bait found. Very unpleasant, but undoubtedly what we need. Just a little more. Oh, wait, what? oh okay, I'm hitting it. I can tell. Oh, there you go. Oh, this is just giving me flashbacks of the last time I was here. Because there was an event going on, so like... It was, um, what do you call it? The, uh... Nabarus, yeah. And... What what you did was you defended this, um... This pot and filled it with, uh... Pieces or whatever of the infested. And, like... The amount of enemies swarming around just, like... My brain. I was, like, I was giving myself a headache. Like, laughing at it. Here we go. I don't- I don't know if that'll be the case again, but I don't- I don't think so. Be on the lookout for infested. They will likely come and I don't know how far in that was to the stream either. I think I was literally doing it specifically for the event, so... I think I... Basically the whole entire time. I... Hey, 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 hey. No more. No more, please. Oh, 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 oh. I get it. Oh, my God. Hitting it, but I'm not hitting it. One left. That's all my ammo. There we go. Switch. I'll just keep it. I'll just keep it um, equipped and then we'll have a quick melee. Take the concoction and throw it against the large cloaca I have marked on the back. Oop, vault. There. Now we can progress into the tunnels. Do not dawdle. Okay. We'll do power. It's so toxic in here, it'll burn your casing up! We need to do something or the vault won't open! Mm -hmm. Oh, the vault won't open. What are we doing? What's that? Oh. Some of the oh. infested are adding to the toxicity level. 
Deal with them quickly. Organic material from the infested can help counteract the environment and keep us alive longer. They are well adapted to this. Keep toxics. Okay, keep toxicity levels below 100. Or the warp drive, so now melee speed. Neil, 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 neil. So there's no like the strongest local other objective. Are Just this keep below one hundred. Yeah. Oh. Get up. Get up. Get up. Oh. At 27. Toxicity levels are dropping now. The infested have retreated. We can proceed to the isolation vaults. Oh, okay. Here we go, here we go. The Entrati ruins are close. Keep pushing, and you will be there in no time. Is there a Penta Prime? That is the question. There is a guardian here, a Necromech. You will need to destroy it so you can explore the ruins. Investigate the ruins. And do investigate. You? The Guardian of the Vault approaches. You must defeat it, Tenno! Okay. It will, will do. This is what I'm supposed to. Disabling one arm is a good start. The Necromech remains 82% <laughs> combat effective. I'm down. Whoa. The status effects on it. You know what? There we go. Oh, it's not. It's not. Is it taking damage? I can't tell. I confess I had my concerns, but that was expertly handled. The Working ballistics matrix. Disabled. Okay. Well, that's one, I guess. The Question mark. The vault approaches. You must defeat it, Tenno. There it is. <laughs> They're fighting it too, don't worry. You got his arm! You're doing great! Oh. And he's I don't think I down. did any damage to it. Never doubted you for a minute, ship! Orkin Ballistics Matrix. Another one of those. <laughs> okay, my turn. I know where that is. But how do I? Oh, there we go. Oh, they're looking for the reactive crystal. Wait, are they? No. Oh. oh, they're trying to crack. They're doing the crack the vault thingy. Are they? Okay, no more. This. Gangline. Gengar. And... Oh.
Oh, I thought I summoned it on them. The timing, though. They weren't underneath of it, they were behind the rock. I thought I summoned the robot on them and it killed them, if that was the case. Oh, I said sorry. Does that kill things when it drops? Wait a second. No, it doesn't. I thought it did, but it does not. They attack it, though. Oh, they did it. You did well, according to Lloyd. A reward is an order for your efforts. I do hope you'll go again. There did is so do? much more to be found. Things hidden from the Where did they go? Oh, no, wait, there they are. You know what they say. The road to good intentions be paved with hell. Oh, an artillery bomber now. How do they fly? That far. Not allowed to use abilities in here. Okay. Seventeen mother token. Acromac Blitz. Plus twenty percent slide attack damage. Okay. There is some. Open to dialogue. Not enough standing. Wait. Spinal core section. So bounties. Yes, there are bounties if you have the interest. So be it. Of course, I very much enjoy our talks. I forget. I don't know how standing works here. Like I don't. I don't know what you do here. Browse wares. My father tried to lead us in standing. martial discipline. Ev, by all means, go fishing unprepared. When I pick Daughter you out token. of a crypto so Cut Be fish. careful with the first incision. One clumsy moment can wreck everything. Until next time. Okay, I don't know how it works. 
uh, standing. I was to be a scientist. Now I see the short-sightedness of mere intellect. Provide me samples. Soon my parents can come crawling to me to beg for my data. Experimental procedures. Capture Demos wildlife. But how do I get standing? That's the question. How how do I get standing though, pal? Don't understand. I'll get it. See you around. I have to find the father to do that. Who are you? I see your father. We needed those rituals. The discipline of it might have kept us from ending up like this. She clawed me. My own daughter. And <laughs> she laughed. Been here so long, it's difficult to remember that this isn't normal. Let's see, then that gives father you have tokens, everything but... you need. Other services. Oh. How's wares? I need standing to get those. <sighs> Here's the problem. You have no components. Weapons require parts. You bring me said parts, I will build you said weapon. Be seeing you again, I'm sure. Grandmother. You're Let's the you one that I have a chin wag. This is where you bring the tokens. Okay. Uh, includes grandmother token, but As how do you? you... Wish. Uh, there we Shall go. We? There it is. That's what I was looking for. So you trade the tokens. The sun's tokens give the most. How do you get sun tokens? Mm, maybe later. Go on, dear. Okay. Always nice to see you. Do stop by again. So the grandmother. I gotta find the sun. The sun is the is the animals. Yes. The sun is the animals. Hey. Wander freely through this savage romping ground as I once did. Oh, she punished me for it. I desired only solitude. And for that, she made me scapegoat. The Atmos pulsing today, friend. Just smell those pheromones. Bring me back a little something. What do you say? Mm hmm. Okay. That. Browse wares. No, no, no. Oh, hey. Heading for the ventricle. If you find an interesting sample or two out in the chamber, say a Vulpophila or Avakea, okay, I'd tags. love a closer look. I can kit you out so it's a more pleasurable experience. Here you go. Take this. Yes, okay. That I is all I have. to your return. Yeah. Bye for now, you shiny thing. Shiny thing. Now, grandmother. Where is the grandmother? That's father. Another isolation vault. Here's the grandmother. Where am I at? Okay. Sure. Much has been hidden from us on Deimos. 
The old ruins beneath the surface must surely contain the deepest and darkest secrets. Find a way to get inside, and the Necroloid will guide you through. See what's happening down there. Tell me what he has been up to. Here you go. There we go. The isolation vault entrances are deep beneath the surface. We'll need to enter infestation tunnels to reach them. The infestation is strong, but stupid. With the right materials, we can fool it into letting us enter. Yummy for a monster door. Let's find some more. Okay, we better get another one to be sure. Oh, I missed it. There we go. Get down. Excellent. Take what you have gathered and place it into the vessel. <laughs> Protect the vessel while it is stewing. The stench is bound to draw infested. Does it always? It looks like it always does that effect. Wait a second. Maybe it's because of the 100% status chance now. Against Orifice Portal and it should open. Hey, 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 no I get what is oh. friendly mech. got down. Couldn't see where the entrance was. Woo! Oh. 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 What was that? There. Now we can progress into the tunnels. Okay. Do not dawdle! Do not dawdle. Okay. We'll do wood. 
is that? Oh, okay. That is their their necromech question mark. I think so. We cannot access the vaults until the toxicity level has been reduced. Some of the infested are adding to the toxicity level. Deal with them quickly. Use organic samples to help stabilize yourself against the toxicity levels. The infested Ooh. carry their own antidote of sorts. They're up top. of the infested in the area. The largest and deadliest specimens from deeper levels. Be careful. Be careful. Will do, Lloyd. I will try. Oh! Just got rolled over by whatever that was. Okay. Let's see. No more. Toxicity levels oh. are dropping now. The infested have retreated. We can proceed to the isolation vaults. Oh, you are almost through maggots. the infested tunnels. The Entrati ruins lie just ahead. Oh. There the is a vault. necromech guarding the ruins. You will need to defeat it in order to roam the ruins. The Guardian of the Vault approaches. You must defeat it, Tenno! Oh! Oh no! themselves. You got his arm. You're doing great. Oh, there we go. I'm doing damage. Ooh. Is it a specific? Please? I think so. Uh oh. There we go. Reviving. And oh, there we go. He's down. Never doubted you for a minute. Just oh. There we go. My health is coming back. The Guardian of the Vault approaches. You must defeat it, Tenno! There. Okay. Where are they? How are they? I was about to say, how are they standing? The Guardian is here. Defend yourself, Tenno! Oh, he just killed me. Okay, yeah, there's spots on it. I didn't even notice. I couldn't even see past, like, the explosions before that were happening. Go again. Oop. You got his arm. You're doing great. This 
waiting for it to happen again. It does. Hey. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Stop that. Oh, 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 I got it. Oh. Ran out of ammo in that. Oh. So it does bleed, I guess. A tenno needs to be revived. Uh, wait, what? You actually say that? I didn't know that. Tenno needs to be revived. She actually says that. The necromech has ceased function. A most satisfactory outcome. Oh, I have his melee. Ooh. All I have is melee. All I have is melee. Can I hit you to get some health back, please? And all I have is this melee. Yep. Yep. Okay. Please, no more. Oh, you're breaking things for me. Thank you. Melee, melee, melee. Oh. Don't worry, I'll get to you. I thought I was gonna get swung at. Oh, there they are. They're swinging. Seconds. Oh, I have ammo. Oh, I'm down again. Let's see, now this is where I think health is the thing. Because I have armor, but I don't have. I don't have more health than three and I do. Ooh. Uh oh. See, I might have to. There we go. Generators activated. Shed no tears for the Necromech, for they are now relentless enemies to all, and there is no countermanding that. Is that a thing to destroy? Okay, no. Well, maybe it was, but it doesn't... 
Oh, generator's activated. The damage being <laughs> yeah. being received. Might be spicy. go. Get the rolls going. Now that I have activated all of the generators, the vault door is now active and awaiting the correct code. can only make three mistakes before the vault will lock permanently. Be sure before you import. know what riches you may find, if any, but you will certainly discover some small measure of wisdom locked away down here. Whoa. 
Very, very good. Resources. You descend and return. Most pleasing. So many descend and remain as remains. Perhaps you might learn more once you strengthen your void. Yeah, I can go in here. It is a difficult place to navigate with only one eye open. I'm allowed to be in here. Okay, I can stand on this. That's a thing. Dude, what happened to our sentinels? They just don't exist anymore. That's that, I guess. This is what was in the vault. Penta rank 28. Most most sullen are are Kubex. Okay, that's the Necromech stuff. Rumblejack rank 20. Can you spell this place? Okay, that done. That doesn't come up as a miss miss spell either. So Is there anywhere I can. Oh wait, on the pillar. There we go. Hi. Yep, there we go. This is my spot now. Just sit up top. Let me look at this quick.
tab out of the game and check this out. Okay. Um. See what's going on down here? No, let me check my. Wait a second. I'm gonna check my uh, friends list. Um, yeah, I don't know. I think, I think that'll be, I think that'll be it. Um, but, uh, here, let me, let me see. Um, I'm gonna go back to my ship. See what happens with that. So it does remove me from the squad when I go back, but, um, yeah, so, uh, that was, that was re, I guess relearning some stuff and getting the, uh, this stuff, forma, yeah, comma, I guess I'm gonna get the dual ramas, I think that's how you say it, question mark? And mag, and well, I'll probably trade stuff for a Warframe slot, like get enough platinum and buy a Warframe slot. Uh, Nesha Prime chassis. I didn't get the other parts for Nesha, but I have the chassis now. Odonata Prime harness, so I'll be able to build the Odonata, uh, and but that'll take like 36 hours to build that after this is done. So, um, yeah. But anyway, uh, thanks for sticking around, thanks for watching, and uh, yeah, I think I'll bring up the stream over screen, and uh, there we go. But um, yeah, uh, let me see. Okay, yeah. But I'll, uh, I'll catch you later.